into our STEM programs and we want to kind of share that experience with a lot of the kids here today. So this is our third fluid power challenge. This is challenge day where the students come back with a portfolio. They bring their tools, their portfolio, and they have to rebuild that model from scratch. Once one o'clock comes, they do a two minute time competition to earn points. After all the teams are completed, we go through and we score everybody and then award trophies and gift certificate for the final winners. And we're fortunate enough to have the gentleman that started this competition with us. I'm constantly surprised with the imagination and the innovation that these grade six, seven, eight students display. As something eighth graders, I think you have an opportunity to kind of build off of something very bare, a good foundation, because they might not know it right now, but it'll probably influence them here in the next few years. We have an individual coming, her name is Sarah Fisher. She competed in one of our competitions a few years back. I've always been passionate about STEM field education and I really appreciate this ha having had this experience because it really allowed me to explore the STEM field of study that I do now. I think that the Fluid Power Challenge is an opportunity for not only Komatsu to kind of get involved with our community, but also for a chance to get involved with the kids who are in the schools around us. I hope that this Fluid Power Challenge inspires the students here today to keep looking for opportunities to express their talents in STEM as they grow older.